Thanks for joining us here on the DenverChannel.com. I'm 7 News meteorologist Maureen McCann. Got a little bit of cloud cover showing up on the satellite and radar, and even a hint of moisture over the western slope. Might see some showers and storms in the mountains today, but the front range and eastern plains will be primarily dry. That's why we have a red flag warning. High fire danger for the counties highlighted in pink, and that warning goes from noon to 8. So that's the window of time the winds are likely going to be the strongest today. Futurecast shows that chance for rain up in the high country, watching this unfold through the afternoon hours between about noon and 2 p.m. Those showers will be a little bit more numerous, but notice how they really don't have much luck in drifting down to the I-25 corridor. The best we'll find is just those scattered clouds mixing with the sun, but it's not going to do much to cool us off. We're still going to be in the 90s today. A couple degrees cooler than yesterday. You know, yesterday we were at 97 degrees, but today 95 will do it for Denver. 60s, 70s, and a few 80s in the high country. So if you're going to be camping there, heading up for the weekend, You'll want to pack accordingly for those cooler overnight readings. 95 with your forecast in writing. Sunshine to start. Some afternoon mountain storms and all that comes to an end tonight. The skies clear out with a good view of the full moon. And then looking ahead to your seven-day planner. More 90s through the weekend. And then once the holiday weekend winds down, 80s return next Tuesday and Wednesday.